welcome to the book release of A Sailor's Story, the autobiography of Padma Bhushan Vice Admiral Nilakanta Krishnan, one of India's most decorated military heroes. The book was released in Hyderabad, India on 17 December 2012 by one of India's most famous and talented actresses, Amala Akineni. Please enjoy the highlights of the ceremony. Vice Admiral Nilakanta Krishnan was one of the most decorated officers in the Indian Armed Forces. After 40 years of distinguished service in the Indian Navy, 17 medals adorned his broad shoulders, including the Padma Bhushan and the Distinguished Service Cross for gallantry in World War II. Known as the Sailor's Admiral, his dedication to his beloved Navy was surpassed only by his love for his country. Flamboyant, charismatic and a dynamic leader of men, this is his story one that is inextricably linked to the story of India and India's Navy. In his own words, he tells of his experiences spanning some of India's most tumultuous times, from pre-independence to post-independent modern India, including his part in building India's Navy and culminating in his pivotal role in one of India's greatest military triumphs, the 1971 war to liberate Bangladesh from Pakistan. His life was fascinating one which most people would only dream about. He rubbed shoulders with royalty, presidents, prime ministers, politicians, military brass, war heroes, extraordinary and ordinary people in the course of his life. And every encounter has a fascinating tale behind it, from Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, Indira Gandhi, Sardar Vallabhai Patel, V. V. Giri, ace fighter pilot Guy Gibson of Second World War, Dambusters fame, Queen Elizabeth the Queen Mother, Lord Mountbatten of Burma, Air Chief Marshal Sir Hugh Dowding of Battle of Britain fame, Russian Grand Admiral Gorshkov. Each story is part of the tapestry that made his life story so interesting. Sit back and enjoy the voyage of his life and take pride in a great Indian and patriot who often said, if you cut open my chest embedded in my heart, you will see four letters in bold, N-A-V-Y. At the outset, let allow me to personally thank you all for honouring us with your presence here today for the launch of my late father, Vice Admiral Nilakanta Krishnan's autobiography, A Sailor's Story, in this beautiful city of Hyderabad and great state of Andhra Pradesh, where he chose to retire after over 40 years of distinguished service to his beloved Navy and country. The questions. The original in 2009, I wrote and had my own book published in the U.S that gave me the confidence and experience to do justice to my father's work. Well, all the stars seem to align and here we are today with a long time wish fulfilled and a pledge redeemed. And why do I feel his story needs to be told? The answer is simple. His was a fascinating life, one which most people would only dream about. Being a master storyteller, he writes with humor and a sincerity that was a hallmark of his personality. From many ferocious sea battles during the Second World War, partition and independence, the siege of Junagadh that kept that state in India during partition, development of the first 10-year plan for the Indian Navy that would make her a naval power to reckon with, the liberation of Goa, Daman and Dew from the Portuguese, commanding many ships, including the INS Delhi, and India's first aircraft carrier, INS Vikrant. Padma Bhushan citation states his remarkable sagacity, foresight, and dominant, dominant, domination that brought about the destruction of all Pakistani naval surface and submarine forces in the area and ensured a complete blockade of the enemy-held ports in the eastern sector. The undisputed control of the Bay of Bengal achieved by naval forces operating in this area under his dynamic leadership, Indian youth, with its great examples of strategy, leadership, courage under fire, and people skills. His constant regard for the well-being of sailors under his command was to earn him the nickname of the Sailor's Admiral. Um, members of the media and friends, it is a great honor for me to be here this morning and I'd like to thank Mr. Krishnan for um, 
for inviting me to be part of this very memorable occasion. I think this um, a good story must be told. Being from a partly film background, I know the value that a good story must be told. And I'm so glad you didn't give up and you brought the book out, even though it's a few decades after it was written. It's a very um, special moment for me. Mm, I, I don't know if many know that my both my parents were naval officers. My mother was with the Royal Navy and my father was with the Indian Navy. And I was born in um, Kalaikunda, which is an Air Force base just uh, uh, outside Kharagpur. And during the Bangladesh war, uh, I remember the fighter planes going overhead and blackouts and the whole of uh, that region was right bang in the middle of that war zone. And I grew up with seeing, looking at the picture of the um, surrender of the Pakistan forces on my father's uh, desk and so the all this is very real to me and all the names you quoted about the Navy and the Russian Navy and Admiral Groshkov and yeah in fact I performed for the, uh, Gra Admiral Groshkov with uh, all the naval children yeah one of my early Bharatanatyam performances so I'm inspired by the book and the story must be told thank you We hope you enjoyed the video. A Sailor's Story is available online worldwide at www.amazon.com and in India at www.flipkart.com. Please contact us at, on Facebook at A Sailor's Story Admiral Krishnan or email us at support at krishbooks.com. Thank you for watching.